a parallel plate capacitor connected to a battery becomes fully charged. And then the space between the plates is filled with a dielectric material with a dielectric constant of 5, while the battery remains connected. By what factor does each of the following change? Capacitance, voltage across the capacitor, the amount of charge on each plate of the capacitor, potential energy stored in the capacitor, and the, the electric field between the plates. C equals to kappa times epsilon naught A over D. Epsilon naught is always a constant. Right now, the A and the D both stay the same, which means the capacitance is proportional to kappa. Without the dielectric material, kappa is 1. With the dielectric material, the kappa is 5, so kappa changes by a factor of 5. Therefore, the capacitance changes by the same factor, 5. The battery stays connected, and the battery maintains constant voltage across its terminals. So the voltage stays the same or changes by a factor of 1. Q equals to CV. The voltage stays the same, so the charge is proportional to the capacitance, and the capacitance changes by a factor of 5. So the charge on the plates changes by the same factor, 5. U equals to 1 half QV. 1 half is a constant, and the voltage also stays the same. So this is proportional to Q, and the Q changes by a factor of 5. So the energy stored in the capacitor changes by the same factor, 5. V equals to ED, so E equals to V over D. The voltage stays the same, and the plate separation does not change. So the electric field changes by a factor of 1. This means that to maintain constant voltage, the electric field has to stay the same. Since the polarized molecules inside the dielectric material weakens the electric field, the battery has to pump more charges onto the plates in order to have the same electric field between the plates as before.